So, um, it's here. I tried to make an unboxing video, but my phone went out of battery, which is why I'm using this phone, which has worse quality. But, um, I haven't turned it on yet. So, this is going to be a first. So excited. My PS TV charger. Or AC adapter. And you'll see the light will go green. Once it goes green, you can just turn it on normally. And there we go. It's booting up. So excited. Okay. So here we are. Um, I have no memory card. My memory card broke a while ago, so I have to wait for a new one to come in. But here we are on the dev kit. Um, so if we go here to your settings. Debug settings. Um, that video, the picture I sent you was um, of it activated. So if you look at the picture I originally sent to my community and then we click on activation here, it will tell you exactly how many days it took her to get here. And here we go. So yeah. Um, it's activated, so I'll be all forever activated. You don't worry about it expiring. If it expires, I have my ways of reactivating this. So. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're going to go on, um, since it's activated, we're going to go download Henkaku. Um, but normally you can't do it on an activated console, as I'll show you right here. If I try go to um, Henkaku XYZ slash go on an activated kit, it won't actually work. Or apparently it does. Okay. That's interesting. It did work. Maybe they fixed that. Um, maybe they fixed Henkaku to work on activated consoles. I don't know. But we go got Henkaku. Now, unfortunately, I can't download anything because, well, I have a memory card. So, <laughs> I have to get a memory card because my memory card broke, so I can't use it anymore. So, that sucks. Um, and this has no internal storage. So... Whatever. I can still connect to the SDK. Probably. But yeah. Also, I found some interesting stuff about um, this console. When I got it, there was this neat little logo on the side. On the sale sticker, it said, do not remove. Um, I'm pretty sure it doesn't do anything if I remove it. But, you know. You get a sort of idea of where this comes from. Um, so yeah. That's neat. Um... <laughs> This is my dev kit. It's mine. <laughs> oh my god. It's mine. And it's awesome. If I go over to, um, you know, I've got everything here. I've got the boot parameters. I can, so you can see it's actually a dev kit. I can put it in development or release mode. I can turn on and off PSTV emulation. And these actually work too. So if I, um, if I do this, it will actually restart into release mode. So, you know. That's awesome. Look, it rebuilds the database when you switch over. But, like, yeah. Um, on charging my phone, I'll be able to get better quality videos out once I do that. I just want to make this really quick here. So, yeah. It's here. I tried to make an unboxing, but my phone died in the middle of recording it. So, whatever. Um, thank you all for watching. This is my dev kit. Um, as you can see, it has got HDMI out. I'll have to test that out at some point. Um, yeah, thank you all for watching. Goodbye.